His name is Lucio Corrado, and he's a native of Brazil. This is his first time celebrating the 4th, and he's doing it by teaching forms of martial arts. On my count, we're going to start with the straight punches, okay? So the 4th of July marks America's independence. This year's celebration is a bit different for Lucio Corrado, a native of Brazil. This is his first time celebrating the 4th. Me as a Brazilian, I learn a lot for, from the Americans. And the 4th of July, I, I feel like how the Americans, they, they love their country and they're so proud to be Americans. So that's great. I like it. Corrado's journey has brought him right here to West Texas, where he coaches Brazilian jiu-jitsu and striking for the Seeds 13 Academy. We, we share a lot of good moments on, at the gym and I learn and I teach a lot of stuff. I have some students, they want to learn Portuguese and sometimes in the class we, I talk in Portuguese, I learn English, so we share those moments. He cemented himself as a pillar of the martial arts community during his time in the States. The entire experience has been a dream come true. It's great for me to be here and I enjoy every single time I'm spending here in America. It was a long time dream to come here and share a little bit like what I learned in martial arts. So I, I feel like it's a dream come true. Knee, go back to your stance. I don't throw the knee and go forward. His time here currently has an expiration date after three years. He's on American soil on a work visa, but is working diligently towards making America, and specifically West Texas, his forever home. This, this is a dream for me, you know. I always have that desire to come here in America, to live here, to teach, to share. My, my goal is to be able to get the green card soon, and if that happens, it's, it's going to be awesome. Awesome indeed. Now, Professor Lucio and the crew at Seeds all teach and compete year-round, so if you'd like to up your grappling or striking, reach out and learn from the best. That does